guys, Carolyn here. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Red Velvet's, I think it's their seventh mini album, um, the Reva Festival Day 2. I have both the limited and the normal editions and I'm super excited because there were no member versions this time, which we enjoy when there's no member versions because for whatever reason, buying Red Velvet member versions is like super stressful. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and get started looking through these and we're going to start with the limited edition because that makes a lot of sense. So, this is what it looks like. It's very similar size and shape um, to their last album. I think that sticker's on the outside, is it? Oh, it's not. That's exciting. SM definitely watches my videos and they were like, this girl can't handle stickers on plastic, so we're just going to stick them on the album for her. I appreciate that, SM. Um, this is the spine. Like I said, it's like the same size as the Rebel Festival Limited Edition Part 1. But then you slip this off oh and i forgot that this is random so there's like a random member kit on the inside and i pulled silgi so we will go ahead and look at this in a moment look how cute she looks i honestly can't even remember what's in this so we'll look at it's a travel kit that's what it's called so we'll look at that in a minute um let me get my photo card out and this is the cd i'm honestly loving this like pale pink on pale purple color combination recently so the fact that red velvet has it in their album is really cute um and then that's the back of the box and let me get the photo book and we'll go through it i'm so excited for this photo book i've seen a couple photos on like twitter of it and it's just like the cutest thing so we need to look through it together right now i even like the oompa oompa music video more than the zim zom bim music video like, look how cute you yeah, enjoy look Oh my gosh. And then I love these outfits. I just think they're really cute. And like the pla I don't know. It's just really cute. But look at that picture of Yeri. Oh my gosh. I saw that one on Twitter. But she's so precious. And then Wendy. I'm really not a big fan of Wendy's short hair. I love her with long hair. But you know she looks really cute. So it's fine. Um, so cute they're at the beach this seems more like red velvet's summer comeback than zim's alabim was oh my gosh look at joy and then, oh look at them on the beach with this oh so cute literally can't handle how cute this photo book is i also love that outfit wendy's wearing i think it's really cute and they're all wearing their colors, too. That photo of Irene is real pretty. Yuri's, like, killing this photo book. Look at her. Look at her go. These are so fun. Like, this whole photo book is so cute and so fun. Look at Silky in that photo. She's so pretty. Look at Joyce. Oh, my gosh. Joy and Wendy. So cute. Joy is my second bias, by the way. So, love her. Um, yeah. So, that's the back. And then, let's go ahead and look through all the stuff you get. Okay. So, this is Silky's travel kit. I haven't decided if I want to trade for Wendy's or try to get Wendy's of this. Well, let's see what's inside first and we'll make a decision because, yeah. Oh my gosh. So, we have this little ticket. Look at it. Look how cute Silky looks in this. Oh my gosh. So, we have that little like bookmark thing and then you get a Polaroid, which I love this. Oh my gosh. She looks really cute in that too. And then you get the little um, ticket thing. There was one in... Ooh, what does it say on the back? There's one on the first album, too. And I have Wendy's for that, so I like probably should get Wendy's for this. Um, and then there's like a billion stickers that are giving me flashbacks to when I bought NCT 127's Limitless album. I'm having like series flashbacks. So <laughs> when I poured out all of those stickers... I think it was the first time I ever did tabletop unboxing because I was like, how the heck do I do this? But yes, look at all these. Oh my gosh, so many things. We got a little Spaceman sticker. 
little red velvet sticker, little camping tent sticker, and then we got a couple a group sticker and then a silky sticker. And like a little house one. And then we got a couple of like silky sticker postcard things. And ladies night sticker. And then that's the back of this. So I kind of really want Wendy's for this. So if you have Wendy's and would like to trade, go ahead and message me on Instagram or Twitter. Because uh, probably US only for this. Because it's like a weirdly shaped thing to trade. But um, I kind of want Wendy's. So <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we have all of that. But then we still have a photo card. There's one of ten I think you get in the limited edition of the album. But first we have the thickest SM ad I've ever seen in my entire life. Thick with two C's. Like look, look at what, look at all this. Oh my gosh. And then the photo card. I think it says members names on the back. It does. So I pulled Irene's. Oh my gosh. Thank God I did not pull that like, that one that's been going around Twitter. The just literally her shadow. I'm so happy I pulled this one. <laughs> look, at, it would have been really funny to pull that other photo card though, but honestly don't think anyone would have traded with me so yeah look how cute okay so next we have the normal edition and again this is like the same size as all of the albums red velvet have released that look like this like very cute and then the photo book i think this is supposed to be different red velvet are pretty good about different photo books oh yeah So now we're like in the desert. We're not really on the beach anymore. So cute. What is Joy doing? I'm not sure. But yeah, this is a good I like a good version for anyone to buy who doesn't want that thick box on their shelf. <laughs> Why do I keep saying thick in this unboxing? I don't know. But anyways, um, yeah, it's a good option for anyone who doesn't want that, like, super thick box because Red Velvet's limited editions are, like, very thick um, and can be difficult to store. But the normal editions are really small and uniform and they look really nice together. So, yes. And you still get all these really pretty photos. Look how cute Joy is with all that fruit. Queen of health. I'm so happy Red Velvet made, like, an actual summer comeback. Like, Sims Alabam was not an actual summer comeback, in my opinion. Got Yuri in a car. Can Yuri drive? I don't know. And then that's the end of the photo book. So I also forgot that you got a postcard in this album too, in this version. So let's look at that. And I pulled Irene. And then you get this like guidebook thing. What is this? Oh, lyrics? Yes. Definitely lyrics. Cute. And then we have another um, Thick with Two C's uh, <laughs> as I've had. So let's look at that. Why is this? Why does SM have so many things in this? Remember when SM ads used to be like literally one page? Like, what happened to that? What is this? What happened to that? Anyways, maybe it's line. Maybe it's not SM. A photo card. As soon as I can put this back. And I pulled Joy. Let's see. <gasps> this is my favorite card of the set. I'm so excited that I pulled this card. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look how cute. Oh, man. I'm going to be so sad to trade this away. But, like, I collect Wendy's photo cards. So, literally nothing against Joy, Irene, or Silgi. I just collect Wendy's things. And that's just... That's just the way I am. So, yeah. I'm so happy I pulled my favorite Joy card because I saw this one on Twitter and was like, literally, this is the cutest card I've ever seen in my life. So, yes. That was my unboxing of Red Velvet's seventh mini album, The Red Velvet Festival Day 2, both the limited and the normal edition. Thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to 
if you would like to trade, go ahead and message me on Instagram or Twitter. Um, and what else is I going to say? If you want to see what else I have coming, go ahead and look in the description box down below. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye.